In today's HealthCast, a weight loss drugs such as Ozempic and Wagovi, they can be problematic if you're a person undergoing anesthesia. This is according to a brand new study published in the journal JAMA Surgery. Now, in this brand new study, researchers noted that those medications can actually create a potentially serious health issues when mixed with drugs used in anesthesia during surgery and other medical procedures because the drugs, Wagovi and Ozempic, they actually slow down the emptying of your gastric contents, the food from your stomach, and that, that increases your risk of having aspiration. That means your stomach contents will enter your lungs during surgery. So last June, the American Society of Anesthesiologists released some new guidance about screening for the use of these medications before surgery. And they also inform patients of the risk of possible adverse outcomes. And they have a recommendation that the medications be stopped prior to having a procedure and undergoing anesthesia. And once again this, this year, Joe DiMaggio Children's Hospital has received $25,000 from the Toy Foundation, all part of the organization's 2024 Children's Hospital Play Grants program. That money will help purchase things like interactive robots like that guy and other play items that really help with kids in their healing. As child life specialists, our job is to help reduce the stress and anxieties of kids in the hospital and we do that through play. Um, most fears are fears of the unknown and so our job is to use the medical tools and play to help kids explore, learn and understand why they're here in the hospital. That's Shannon Bajwa, a child life manager at Joe D. And she says this year's grant will allow them to buy some items that are going to be helping out the babies in the intensive care unit.